Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am back with a new vlog and this one is very, very exciting because if you follow me on Instagram, you will have seen that I'm in Cape Town, South Africa at the moment. I've been here for like a month already, but we are not in Cape Town anymore. We're about three hours outside of Cape Town. We're on safari. How cool is that? Like, oh, I'm so excited. We did it two years ago already but at a different place and now we're doing it again ah oh, it's gonna be so nice this time we're at kungana tented camp safari i'll probably link it down below so you can check it out we are staying here for two nights so we have two days of safari we have like so many game drives and we get to see lots of animals so that's just gonna be really really fun and that's janine in the background i'm here with my mom who's visiting from germany and janine of course is also staying in cape town so it's the three of us and we're staying for the first night in these tented camps it's about 10 15 minutes outside of the normal camp say hi janine hi and um this is where we're staying for the first night and the second night we're just staying in the normal camp i think but i will give you a tour of the tented camp because like you can already see in the background it's insane we're like in a camp in the middle of the game reserve in a tent in like the most luxurious tent ever and it's just insane so yeah i'm very excited and that will take you guys with me for the next few days and the plan for today is we just arrived it's about three o'clock so in an hour we're gonna get a snack and then at i think i believe at five o'clock we're gonna go on the game drive so yeah that's the plan for today and then tomorrow morning probably an early early game drive but obviously i'll take you with me but first i want to show you the tent so let's do the tent tour i have my mom behind the camera she's filming me whilst i give you a tour of our tent i'm staying in tent with my mom because i'm scared to stay by myself so first of all we have this rug i'm not very fond of it, it kind of freaks me out but let's continue and i will show you the rest of the tent so you come in this is the massive bed and I love the wallpaper in the background, it's so cool. The interior is super nice, there's so many details everywhere, like it's so pretty. And then this is the wallpaper, this is the loo, and this is the sink. So this is the bathroom area now, in the back of the bedroom. And then here, you can have a shower, you know, wash your hair, and you look out to the wilderness. How sick. Oh my god, I can't believe it. They have robes! So this is like the beauty area. You can sit here and do your makeup and they even have robes. That is so cool. I love that. And then you come back around. You've got a little mini bar here. Ooh, cheeky little Coke. And coffee and everything and a safe. And then you come back around. Yes, that was the camp tour. I hope you enjoyed it. It's incredible. I don't think I've ever stayed at a tent this fancy. Have you, Mama? Mm-hmm. Have you? Us. Stayed at a tent this night? No. No, nor have I. You are taking. filming a vlog. Hi, kiss the camera. <laughs> and I wanted to also show you this is the pool area by the tent. And apparently, sometimes the animals come here. How did you enjoy the fruit platter? Um, the mango is amazing. I love mango. It was the first time I actually had mango in a long, long time. It feels so refreshed and full of vitamins. Very nice. And you, Mama? Mm -hmm. Delicious? Mm -hmm. Good. Morning guys, it looks as though I'm somewhere in the Arctic. I don't think I've ever worn a thick jacket and a beanie in South Africa before. But that's because it's about 6.30, which is actually quite late because if you've seen last two years ago my vlog from safari at Akila you will have seen that we had to get up at like 5 for sunrise so it's only 6.30 and we're going on the early safari now because that's when you see the most animals so you're gonna see giraffes and elephants today which we haven't seen yesterday oh, my mother has just come out of the tent I had such a good night's sleep and yeah this is my luck Let's go! So cool, it's pretty much a private game drive because it's just the three of us. I'm looking very stylish, but I'm very
we're getting a little bit rough because we just got back from the game drive and it was very windy. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you. Why am I looking so pale compared to Jenny? I don't know. I just wanted to show you our breakfast today. It's right there. I'm going to show you now. It's over there. Over, over there. There. First of all, how... <laughs> Oh. Like a colada, Cheers! Cheers! This is our breakfast setup. They've done it so beautifully. We have all this fresh fruit, which I obviously won't touch because I hate fruit. But we've got um, granola. I can see there's another issue. It's got raisins. I hate raisins. <laughs> <laughs> then we've got some wheat picks. I don't know. I've never had this. And then cornflakes. Yeah. And then apparently there's also a warm breakfast coming. But they've set it up so beautifully. Wow. Incredible. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh -huh. We're lying by the pool and all of a sudden all of a sudden we hear a noise. Now I need to show you. Oh my god. It's two of them. Oh my god, I can't believe this. Excuse the state that I'm in. I literally just rolled out of bed. Woke up from a longest nap. I think I slept for like an hour and a half. And apparently, I woke up in the middle of the nap, like set up in bed, ripped off my sleeping mask. I was like, "What? What?" <laughs> my mom told me because we were sharing a room. So she was like, "What happened? Like, do you not remember?" I was like. No, I don't have a clue. Anyway, the nap was amazing. Quick update, we're no longer at the tents. We're now at the main part of the camp, which is the Inverdorn Private Game Reserve. And this is where we're staying for one more night. And then we're heading back to Cape Town. We could do two more safaris, like tonight and tomorrow morning. But I think we're only gonna do one more game drive tonight. And then tomorrow morning, just sleep in and head back. So that's the plan for now and it's so nice out and so sunny that I really want to go out and lie by the pool. So I think that is what I'm going to do and then I will see you later for the game drive. I don't know how much I'm going to show you again of the game drive because I feel like eventually it's just going to get boring if you have to see one more antelope or one more spring buck. But it's fun for me <laughs> and it's actually really cool to see all the animals. So yeah, I'm going to see you at the pool. <laughs> It's a Sunday and we are right now in the car as you can see and we're contemplating where to go for breakfast Well technically I already had breakfast at home because later today I'm going to this food tasting menu trial thing So I want to have like a super light lunch at breakfast because I want to have a lot of lunch so I already had a smoothie at home So it's just Daniel that has to go for breakfast but he doesn't know where to go and also it's like raining a little it's bit. such a dilemma. So we don't want to go to the market. But yeah, right now we're in the car. We're figuring out where to go. Probably going to head into town. And then we'll see you for breakfast. Yay! I feel so sorry for the chicken as the editor video. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear me because it is quite loud. But we've decided to come to Jason's Bakery. And I've actually never been before. So I'm very excited to try it out. Well, technically I'm not going to try it because we don't already have breakfast. They have pastel de nata. And if you remember from my Portugal vlog, I need to try a pastel de nata. So, okay. Oh my god, my vlog camera is so low. I might have to film it on my phone, but I'm going to try it. Okay, just stop. Bear with me. Okay, bye. Uh, uh, what is this one called again? Boris. Uh, they didn't have it. It was finished because it was it's finished. So okay, so it's so popular, so it has to be good. So I can't wait to try at the next place. Um, I only tried pastel. You don't know how to pronounce pastel de nata. Pastel de nata. Well, anyway, they have this. Do you remember from my Portugal vlog? I actually only um, I didn't film it, but I did try one eventually, but at the surf camp. So I feel like we should try it, and I feel like Daniel should try it because you've never been to Portugal. My little uncultured. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, they have so many pastries here and it looks so good. Oh yeah, get the shots. Look at him. Such a little insta ho. <laughs> that escalated so quickly. So I got an orange juice. But then I also got, and I will show you now, 
a chocolate croissant. We only got one pasta donata, and it turns out Daniel already had it. And then he got this massive bagel with chicken, whatever, weird stuff, nothing that I like. Let's try the pasta donata. Oh my god. This one is way better than the one that I had in Portugal, Daniel. Okay, look at the egg. Look at the egg here. No, look. Daniel, listen. It's way better than the one I had in Portugal. Look here, look here. Look at the egg. Oh my god. We just finished breakfast. It was absolutely delicious. I can't believe I've never been to Jason's bakery before. I can't breathe. Yeah, Daniel had a little bit too much to eat. So did I. It escalated so quickly. I was like, I already had breakfast. I'm just going to get a juice. My hair stuck in the door. And I ended up having like, uh, how much? 75% of the chocolate croissant and half of the pasta de nata. And we, we had got, the whole thing. We got a whole um, piece of sourdough bread for takeaway, which is so... A whole loaf. Loaf. A whole loaf of sourdough bread for takeaway which is so dangerous because when i have bread at home just eat it all it's it's honestly it's so dangerous but you know it's gonna be worth it it's gonna be so delicious i usually get my bread from the market so I'm curious to see how this one tastes and how long it lasts because i am gonna eat it look how long my hair is it's grown it's so long <laughs> yours isn't i'll tell you that your hair is not long <laughs> this is a choice not really. We quickly ended up going past the waterfront, which is like the shopping mall here. Um, Cause Dan had to get some stuff tailored and I just went for a little bit of a shopping spree. And I want to show you two things that I got cause they are very exciting. And I know Daniel's also dying to know. I got a Christmas tree decoration. I got the star for the top. So I, I don't think I ever had a proper star on top of the Christmas tree. So I'm very excited for that. And I just got the proper like little thing here at the bottom. So you put it on. So I'm going to take this back to Germany with me in December when I go home for Christmas. And then the second thing that I got. I know it's in a plastic bag. Um, I need to carry it somehow. Don't kill me. And I reuse this plastic bag. So. Oh my god. What? So this goes underneath the lid. Oh, so this is really cool. And it's got this thing that you can put inside with like fruit or like I hate fruit. Lemon, for example. And then it's got a taste. And then this is it. This is so cool. I'm going to give this a wash now in the bath and then I'm going to fill it up. Let's do it. This isn't the most professional way to do it, but I have to do it in the bath because there's not enough space in the sink. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh, I went on my sock. Okay, wait. I'll put you down and I'll show you. Okay, here we have it. Freshly washed from the bathtub. And now this is where I always get my filtered water from. So now I can just go like, wait, how do I know it's closed? Oh my God! Why is it coming out? Does it have a hole? I left you off with the water thing, which um, I thought it leaked, but it hadn't. I just like didn't close it properly or whatever. So a couple of hours have passed since then and I've been to the um, summer menu launch of Nourished, which is a vegan health food cafe here in Cape Town, which I told you about earlier, which is why I didn't want to have breakfast. Oh my god, my battery's almost empty. Okay, let's do this quickly. And it was so delicious. I didn't film anything with my camera, but I did, took lots of videos on my phone, lots of pictures. So I will insert everything in here now. 